Hello everyone. Today we are editing a SCOM file with Dr. eLearning. When you upload a file, Dr. eLearning provides various SCOM editing options. A published and large SCOM file is hard to handle and even harder to edit, but it can be done easily with Dr. eLearning. Separating, downloading and even replacing the files can be easily done by Dr. eLearning. So let us start. On the dashboard, here, click this button, I want to create a project to upload a project. After uploading, you will see your project in the grid. In the manage column, click go to project. Here, on the project dashboard, you will see the various options and the distribution of multimedia in a pie chart form and also the percentage. Now, on the project dashboard, there is option to compress, edit file, preview, download and even delete. Let's go to edit file. Here you can see in the grid all of your SCOM files from code to images to videos. Using the filter can help you easily detect the files. Just apply the filter if you want images, text, videos, whatever you want. You can even filter with the size with ascending and descending order. For now, let's apply a filter for the images. We go to the drop downs, select the image and search. Now, here you can see in the grid, all the images have been filtered out. Let us select one and start editing. Now here you can see the preview of the image. You have an option to download this file. You can even see the width and height in the description. Here when you click the download button, your file will be downloaded for editing purposes. Now let us say you want to change the image completely. So instead of downloading, you can just browse an image. Select the image you want to change it with or replace it with. Let's say we want to replace it with this image. We will open it up. It is loaded. Now before we submit it, we will make sure that it matches the width and height of the previous image. So we match the dimension and we submit the image. As you can see, the image is changed. Even after editing, like if you want to apply a filter or maybe photoshop it a little bit, make sure to match the dimension so it can perfectly fit in your project. Separating files, downloading, editing has been made easy with Dr. eLearning. If you filter out text, you can see all your JavaScript, text file and codes that has been used in your project filtered out. Open it up, download it and edit it as you like and then upload it again. This is a simple and powerful flow of Dr. eLearning for editing the SCOM. If your project contains video files, you can filter video, search for it and you can see all your videos in the grid. And the same flow applies here too. Select a file, download it, edit it and replace it. And that's how easy it is with Dr. eLearning.